Yeah, I mean, obviously, uh, just try to take it, take everything in. Um, you know, in reality, it wasn't much different than a lot of other times walking off the field. As unfortunate as that is. What do you remember about your six years? So, and just everything you had to put in these last six years. Um, you know, honestly, um, you know, a ton of the, ton of the guys I came in with aren't here. Um, you know, the guys I was closest with weren't are no longer here, and. Um, you know, so it provided a unique opportunity for me, you know, kind of to, to grow and make, make new bonds with these younger guys and this, this next generation of, uh, you know, Nebraska players. And, um, you know, so it's definitely a, a blessing. Do you feel like the game turned on the block punt? Is it that straightforward in terms of the momentum of it? Yeah. Um, obviously, that was when they, they started to score. Um, you know, we, we got. Two, two chances to get off the field in, in the first half and on scoring drives two on interceptions. Um, you know, so that, that also kills us. And where do you, where do you feel this defense is at as you sort of leave it, uh, kind of the foundation of it going into 22? Yeah. Um, you know, they're, they're going to lose a few pieces, but I think they're going to, you know, keep the majority of the, the majority of the guys, and uh, you know, um, the the leadership that, that is staying will um, you know keep the unit going. Um, you know, it's really just about being consistent. It's not it's not overly hard to play defense. It's not you don't got to make it complicated. Um, you know, those guys are starting to understand it. You just got to get mature dudes that are disciplined enough to to do the you know the little things, the boring things. Like it, it's not a you know it's not flashy. You know, playing good defense. So uh, I think they're starting to understand that, um, and and they'll, uh, you know, going forward, uh, I think they'll they'll keep that going. Yeah, are you glad you came back this year? Yeah, without a doubt. Um, you know, I was at one point in time. I was <clears throat> last year. At one point in time, I was. I, I told my friends this from back home. I was, there was a one percent chance I was coming back. And uh, you know, over the course of the, the last few weeks of the season, that, that swayed, and um, you know, there's a lot of there's a lot of things that, that weighed on me. But um, ultimately, yeah, super glad. Um, just relationships um, I was able to build, and uh, you know, just to be able to, to help out this program another year is an honor. Do you feel like personally, you improved in some of the ways as a player that, that you were hoping to in the in your last year here, coming back for an extra one, and, and what do your next steps look like? Yeah, for sure. Um, you know, my my goal coming back was, you know, obviously just to be more consistent run and pass wise, right? Um, so uh, overall, I, I think I accomplished that. Um, you know, it's always just it's never a, a never ending process. So you know, it's just got to keep working, um, and then that's kind of why I love the sport. Um, you know, just perfecting the details. Um, Going forward, I mean, I don't have a lot of things um, figured out. My focus was on the season, um, regardless of what our record was in, in beating Iowa. So um, I got a lot of things to figure out next level wise um, in, the, in the coming weeks. You said your mind kind of changed last year about coming back for the guys that have to decide that now. I mean, I'm sure some might be leaning a certain way now, but is there something about the choir, the rest of the next few weeks that sometimes changes opinions or, or how did that go? You think? Yeah, I mean, I think honestly, there was there was not very many guys coming back at one point in time last year, and then um, you know other guys obviously kind of getting together, swayed each other's decisions. So I think um, you know they have an impact. It's it's an individual decision, but it's also uh, you know you got teammates and people you care about a lot here. So um, it definitely can have an impact. I think. Ben, obviously, you spent a lot of time here with Adrian. What was it like on Sunday? You know, finding out that he wasn't going to be able to play and what was it like sort of, I guess, watching him over this week handle being injured and not able to go? Yeah, I mean, obviously, um, my heart breaks for that kid. Um, put his his entire life, his entire body, um, everything he had into this program and, um, you know, not him not being able to finish this season really, really hurts. Um, he's obviously our leader. Um, I mean, even I'm older than him significantly, right? I'm two or three years older than him, but I, I look up to him just leadership wise, um, no matter what, the way he carries himself, um, you know, he's a, he's a great human being. Ben, this game, you guys had a 15 point lead in the second half. Were there, were there moments on the sideline where you were Maybe envisioning what could possibly happen than to have that not finish the way you wanted it to. What's the level of 
guys coming to terms with the result from today? Yeah, obviously. Um, I mean, we were talking about we, we're up by 15. Um, at that point, they're going to start throwing the ball more, and um, so that was that was really all our conversation, and that was where we wanted them, um, make them drop back consistently and throw the ball because that's that's not their strength. And so, um, you know, we, we had them right where we wanted them as far as as far as that goes. You played an empty ring as all last year. What is this year this opportunity to play in front of Husker Nation, despite some of the disappointment? What did it mean to you to, to have that opportunity? Play for the Husker fans. Yeah, um, I, I said this earlier this week, but the fans here make this this university, and um, they make the experience here, and they, they're, they that's what makes it so great to play at Nebraska. Um, so yeah, it was obviously super weird last year not having that, and uh, you know, just just glad to be able to come back for this season to play play a real season with the fans and um, everything that they they incorporate with the program.